All right, guys. Good morning. It's about eight o'clock or so right now. Uh, just got up. Cold, guys. Cold. Um, I was actually pretty comfortable in my little sleep system this morning. Uh, <coughs> had it uh, had it all set out, and uh, it worked out pretty well. Uh, I was pretty cold when I got out, though, so I uh, banked my fire last night. I uh, still have some coals in here. We're going to move those around and, and see if we can get this thing started with uh, with just the fire uh, without having to use anything else. But, uh, good morning. All right, guys, banking a fire. I really, I just did an upside down fire last night. So, uh, basically, it burned down. It had a bunch of coals left. Just stack all the coals together. Uh, gives it a nice. If you can put all the coals together, guys, uh, it condenses that heat into one spot. Okay, and then. All you got to do, no lighting in the morning. Um, very simple to get it started back up. As you can see, I just stacked a couple of the couple of the coals together, stacked some of the wood up. You don't even have to start with little little stuff. You can just go ahead and stack on there, and uh, it's awesome because I'm wanting some coffee this morning. So I'm gonna do some coffee uh, after this gets good and going. And then we'll get right into to what we're doing today. All the charred stuff too burns really good. We're gonna get some coffee going. As soon as that uh get some some cold started and uh, warm up a little bit by the fire. It's kind of cold. Warm my gloves up a little bit. Alright, I'm going to move to right here. <coughs> Alright guys, got a fire going. Um, I'm going to let this cook up a little bit more, get some coals going. Uh, and then I'll cook up breakfast. Got uh, some oatmeal for breakfast, going to get some coffee going. And then I'll... Uh, I'll get back to you. Trying to stay out of the, the flames here. Uh, what are we doing today? Well, got the fire going. You guys saw a simple, simple and easy way to get these fires going, guys, before you go to bed. Uh, got pretty cold, still pretty cold. The wind's kicking up. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and... Uh, I got a couple announcements while I'm doing this. I think I'm just gonna eat my, my bar this morning. Oh, uh, if I can find my bar, where's my bar? Ah, here it is, my bar. Epic Performance Bar, this one's uh, peanut butter. Yeah, peanut butter. So, uh, chow down on this this morning and uh, talk to you guys a little bit. We, uh, we have a lot of stuff planned, guys. I'm starting up a uh, workshops for anybody who may be interested in learning different types of survival, uh, doing, you know, firecraft, shelter building, water gathering and purification, food gathering, 
all that kind of stuff. So we're gonna we're gonna start that up, kick that up. Uh, I will attach links to all of that down in the description. And um, classes, my courses are starting back up. It being spring, everybody wants to go out in the spring and summer. So uh, my full-on beginner, moderate, expert survival courses are starting back up as well. Um, those are a couple of announcements we have. Big one. Big announcement, guys. We, uh, we found out uh, back in January that uh, we're going to be having a baby girl, right? So I am excited, guys. That smoke is in my eyes. <laughs> so we're going to be having a baby girl in September. And that's why I've been pumping out videos, guys. I'm trying to get as much content to you. Uh, while I can because um, it's going to be a lot harder for me to get content out to you so we're going to be knocking these out and now I'm going to finish up breakfast uh, finish up my coffee then my bone comes survival kit that I have for you I want to get to a to a more remote location and uh, so we're gonna move spots here get into the actual woods of the park um, and do do a do a nice little scenario type video um, so I'm gonna finish taking this down uh, finish up my coffee and yep all right uh, finish up finish up my coffee sanitize the camp and that's basically where we're at right now so uh yeah that's basically where we're at
right, guys. Uh, sorry about the, the ending to that. I know it was not the best. Um, I was rushing to get out of there. If you guys saw my live after I got back, I explained in there. Uh, the girls had their uncle. Um, they were at their uncle's and aunt's, and uh, he had to be taken to the hospital. Uh, he's all good now. Um, but I had to go get them. So, we're... We're there. Uh, we're doing good. Uh, he's doing fine. And now we're just waiting on the next adventure, guys. Uh, which brings me to my huge announcement that I wanted to tell you guys. Um, if you have watched it all the way through, awesome. I appreciate it. Uh, I know this one wasn't as exciting. But the announcement, guys, uh, the Bushcraft Gathering, the Georgia Bushcraft Gathering for 2019, has. Uh, um, I will be teaching. Uh, and going around and talking to everybody I can um, and whoever wants to listen about whatever you know they want to talk about so um, that's something that I'm gonna be doing uh, and that's this weekend so I know it's not been a lot of content out this week um, I will do a couple on uh, some of the traps and stuff that I'm gonna be taking I'll make some videos while I'm doing that and stuff but I'm doing a course on water purification uh, different methods I'm doing a course on making traps, primitive traps, all that stuff. So, if you guys are interested in any of that, uh, Carly Fairchild's going to be doing her basket weaving. Uh, a lot of guys are doing some leather stuff. Uh, just a multitude of things, guys. So, I'm going to have that link for the Facebook page and the Instagram down in the description down here. Check it out. Uh, if you're interested in it, they have all the information on how to attend on their page. Um, and I'm just pretty, pretty excited, guys. So, I wanted to throw that in the video. And also, I got, let me cover up the, I got a package. I know who this is from, guys, but I wanted to go ahead and, uh, I wanted to go ahead and do an opening of it real quick. And they boxed it up. And, to the opening, I got my knife. Got my knife this time. <laughs> so, but, told him when he uh, said he was going to send it to me. That I really loved what he had done when he made it. Uh, and I am talking about Dark Steel, guys. If you have not checked out his channel, I will have him up here somewhere, as well as down in the description. So check him out. He has two channels: Dark Steel and uh, Dark Steel Unmasked. So you guys definitely check that out. Um, but he sent me a nice little toy here. So can you get in here? really wrapped it up guys i am so excited to be able to use this i'm glad it came before i'm going guys it's gonna be awesome um ha -ha! all right all right guys check that out it is a nice multi-tooled machine that i can do and has a little connection i can drill it in um make little anything i want really oh that is awesome Definitely going to see this in a lot more videos, guys. Um, nice little shovel tip. It's also got sharpened sides. And a nice little holder. I can I can pretty much put it in whatever I want to right here. Um, could use it as a nice little spearhead and stuff. So, yeah, no, this is going to be going on my channel a lot. Um, stay tuned for that. I appreciate that, Dark. Thank you so much, buddy. Um, and you will definitely see that in more videos to come. But, uh, all right, guys, um, that's all the announcements that I had. I was just dropping in to do the video, and this actually came in the mail today. So, <laughs> um, we will, don't forget to uh, like, share, subscribe. Uh, definitely get it out there, guys. Um, if you are interested, you guys can contact me. Uh, I'll have my, my email down in the description, too, if you guys have any questions. And, yeah, that's about it, guys. Appreciate you watching. Appreciate you tuning in. We'll get back to you next time. Thank you so much, guys.